Angry parents complain their kids aren't getting enough to eat at school. And there's one meal in particular that a family in Chickasha is calling ridiculous. They say that it needs to change. Fox 25's Rebecca Schleicher joins us now live from Chickasha with why the school says that its hands are really tied in this deal. Rebecca. Well, Mike, Wendy, the family's daughter, took this picture of the meal served at Chickasha Public Schools every other week. They say this needs to change, but the district is pointing the finger at the federal level. They say they have to follow strict USDA guidelines that includes meals just like this one. This is the meal Caitlin Shelton gets every other Monday. A problem, she says, because the 17-year-old is eating for two. It makes me want to, like, take that and take it to the superintendent and tell him to eat it for lunch. Chickasha Schools calls it a munchable, and Caitlin and her father say the $3 meal is not good enough for any student, much less one eight months pregnant. I can go pay a dollar for a lunchable and get more food in it. The school district says there were more options like beans and pears that day, but the superintendent agrees there's a problem. He says it's thanks to federal regulations to fight childhood obesity, which limit calories. You've got some cases, little kids that their only two meals are breakfast and lunch at school, and they're getting, you know, a grand total of 1,100 calories. Um, that's not enough. As for the Munchable, high school students are supposed to get five options, but students only have to accept three. And state nutritional regulators say the meal passes federal guidelines. We have a meat-meat alternate, we have the bread grain, we have a vegetable. It's the student's choice of what they want to take. But even she says the regulations are frustrating. These regulations were put into effect two years ago, and we're still struggling with them. Chickasha administrators say kids are going hungry. I know they are. Um, there is no doubt about that. So, um, and this, I mean, my own kid comes home, and the first thing he does is raid the refrigerator. Well, this family says they just want to make sure their kids get the nutrition and calories they need. Schools are responsible for the children while they're at school. They're responsible for feeding the children. Well, the superintendent says that they are re-examining the Munchable as a food option every other week in Chickasha Public Schools. But the state says there is no exception for students who are pregnant or perhaps athletes who are burning more calories per day than an average student. So everybody is on the same playing field. Reporting live in Chickasha, Rebecca Schlenker, Fox 25 News.